hello friends welcome to coding simplified and today we will see how to do or how to make websites using web server so web server is basically a web development environment so uh, we make website using the apache and the mysql and the php so that is the complete and very good environment for making the websites so which will be host in the local host which will be your local server so uh, first we need to download the web server so what you do uh, on any browser just uh, give the input web and as soon as you hit the web the first link which is the official website of web server so here if you go in this side then uh, this will be uh, something like this and then go to the download option so when you go to the download option then according to your operating system that whether it is 64 bit or 32 bit you can download the web server so like i have the 64 bit so i have downloaded the 64 bit version right so uh, i won't do it again so here i have downloaded the web server so now install this then click on ok now accept the agreement click on next click on next and then <clears throat> it is saying that it will be uh, uh, if you want to change your location so i don't want to change the location then click on next click on 64 click on install so now it's uh, asking that whether uh, the default in internet explorer will be used as a browser if you want to change so you can change it later too so uh, i am saying uh, no do you want to choose another no it's okay and uh, it will be not paid will be used as a text editor so just click on no and uh, now it has installing the services okay so uh, give the allow access so now click on next and click on finish so uh, once you installed the web server then there will be a desktop icon so just click on this and uh, uh, it will ask to allow so click on yes if it is green it means the services are running right it means all services are running and if you click on this so uh, there will be all the options like start all the services or stop all the services or restart all the services right so according to your requirement you can do that now uh, there is one php my admin so once you click on php my admin so basically it's a admin of your system where you can uh, where you can create the database or where, where you can create their tables and all that thing so at first it is asking about the uh, this is the home page of php my admin so the language is english and login as so by default the uh, pass username is root and there is no password right so just click on go and now it will display the php my admin okay so okay now uh, this is the uh, this is a console of the php my admin now you can create the database from here and as well as you can create the tables so uh, like this is the database thing so when you create the new right so it is asking about the create database so let's say my database is test right and let it remain as collision so like create so it is saying database has been created so after creating the database then you can create the table also as per your need right so uh, as of now we want to create the table as there is no need we will just create the first website so uh, once you install the web server then in the c in the control c there will be a folder created as web 64 right so just click on this vamp 64 and there will be a folder www right so here you host your websites right so just go to the website and this is the index.php right so this is the uh, this is basic which is which is uh, already hosted basic website or default website so for example if you go to the local host here and just click on the local host 
so that is the website which is hosted by the web server itself right so that will give you the uh, this page but if you want to host your website so what you can do just you can remove whatever is there just delete them and let's create your own uh, first website so uh, let's create the index.php which will be our first entrance web page so index.php then edit this file so edit in the notepad or any browser yes so let's create the this is html slash html then uh, let's write the we are uh, ignoring the head section let's create the body and uh, mm, then you can just give the basic heading section so let's say hello world so now uh, just save the file and uh, reload in the chrome so give the local host because by using local host we can access the site so as soon as you hit the local host uh, that hits the index.php and that gives the output what you have written which is hello world so as well as you can also access this site using index.php so it understand it because index.php is the entrance for the vamp so even if you give the local host then it understand it okay index it has to hit the index.php right so this is a basic index.php website and you can again add the another pages okay so uh, we have created or uh, the very basic website then you can add your other good websites so uh, that's it for this tutorial we have covered the installation then uh, we checked the php my admin how to create the database then you can create the tables and then we hosted the, our uh, basic website so thanks friends for watching the video and please subscribe the channel for more tutorials thank you